G'day, my name's Alan Baldwin. I'm an Akubra wearing sunglass tote in English born Australian and I call myself the Canny Carper. He's the dude who's in the mood to pull some carp out for you. He's the dude who's in the mood to show you just what to do. Morning all, nice still day, back on the same swim, I've decided to keep coming here because I'm going to try different uh, baiting options, hook bait options that is, I'm maintaining the uh, carpet bombing with the sweet corn, I'm not carpet bombing, I'm just throwing out a a tin every day that's all well the corn comes out of the tin i take the tin home but you know what i mean <laughs> see how we go today it's um the hester hector pascals are up so the uh we've we've got a bit of a, a slight high coming over us but we have these lovely clouds that are nice and low and they're approaching from the west so um this is usually good carping weather, in my experience anyway. Let's hope it's the same today. Another picture perfect day. Not a breeze in the air. Will be a bit later, it'll get up, always does. Been getting a couple of these really sharp, fast bites on the uh, right hand rod. That's the one where I've got the the topper with a bit of sweet corn on top of it. it looks like two bits of sweet corn they're on a hair rig i think what's happening is some of these trout that the fisheries have uh, stocked in this lake over the past few months have um, been taking just the sweet corn so because <laughs> yeah either either the sweet corn or the topper is missing when i get these really ferocious bites and they're never hooked so they're obviously just taking the the hair and not sucking the uh, the hook into their mouth like a, a carp would. So it's understandable, but uh, yeah, they're pesky. The wind is uh, coming from behind me today. As you can see, I've got the clear, unruffled water in front of me and it's blowing away from me. So it might be a good test today to see if uh, this slight change in conditions keeps the fish away from me. Perhaps they're all over that far bank now, being pushed over there by the wind. It's not really strong wind, but uh, any ripples ripple. Very strange weather today. They told us that we weren't going to get any rain. We've had a little bit. You can see the brolly's slightly damp. And there's some low cloud. So none of the pilots are going to be saying Cav OK. There's no clear air vertical. Well, not that bit, but over there there is. Look at this. Yeah, this is where the weather's coming from. It's going to be a bit, a bit nicer soon. It's, well, it's not nice now, but it's reasonably high pressure and no wind, which is fantastic. So back to it. Get back under cover. Well, I suppose the next time somebody says to me, why do you go fishing, Alan? I'll just show them this. Ooh. Might have had a bit of a liner there. Three ducks have just landed in my swim and promptly fallen asleep. <laughs> How do they do that? So I'm on the wrong side for the uh, the net, clearly. It should be interesting. Whoa, here we go. Oh. Just come round here. Oh. Thank you. 
Aha. So the uh, the hook has come out, which is good. Great feature barbless hooks, aren't they? So he's fine. There's the rig. We'll uh, show you that a little bit later. Nice catch, mate. Thank you. That's beautiful. Wow. Here he is. Ooh. <laughs> and that's why we have them on the mat. Here he is. Beautiful fish. Very nice. He's uh, just a, just about a double, I'd say. So, well, that was good news, wasn't it? Getting the fish. Hmm. He was a nice, nice fat one. I think um, they get in their condition, which is always good to see. Always good to see. He uh, came on a, a rig, which is a topper and a piece of fake corn, and I'll uh, show you that right now. So here's the rig that I got him on. Just, uh, it's one of these ones I bought from uh, off the internet. About oh, what, five inches of braid up to a, a little swivel and then I've just got a running sink. Oh no, I should have a, probably should have a bead to protect that knot. I, I might do that. Although, I nah, don't think it's gonna cause any major dramas. And uh, there's my fake corn with the topper. That's uh, critically balanced, so it's floating off the surface about, yeah, it'd be about two inches up. So I guess it's a sort of, oh, it's a rig to deal with choddy conditions and just, you know, general debris on the, on the, on the floor of the lake, on the bed. Hmm, so yeah, it was good fun. How's that for an angry looking sky? Looks angrier than it actually is. And that's uh, already past us. But we're getting some rain. Luckily I've got the brolly up again. But yep, some rain coming down now. So, just got one rod out. I'll flick the other one out when I get a chance. Oh, lovely carby carby day today now. Oh, look at this. Nice bit of rain, no wind. Shouldn't say a bit of rain, should I? Nice drop of rain, no wind. Oh, had one already. He's sulking in the margins at the moment. He's the dude who's in the mood to pull some carp out for you. He's the dude who's in the mood to show you just what to do.